Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Metal City. The drought's almost over, so we're going to start as we do. And there's a little surprise at the back tank. It's montage time. And that's the end of the wet season. And we had another nine day drought, which I can tell because we are two levels below the max, which seems to be the thing. That seems to be the, the, the maximum that this tank is gonna go. So for anyone wishing it went all the way, <laughs> it's not gonna happen. Sorry. And we have a 42 day drought. It just, I guess doesn't really matter anymore. It's not true, it's not true. It can still matter. If we had multiple like 50 something day droughts, it would matter a lot. The real question to have here is what you guys think of my uh, waterfall feature? Did you like it? Did you like the beavers? <laughs> uh, that was suggested and I was like, eh, I don't know. We'll see if it works. And uh, it worked super cool. And I really, I had to delete a bunch of this. That was my, that was my big surprise. This was, this was it. I, 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 I did it. I d deleted the, the levels so that it cascaded nice. Because I liked the way that it looked with two, two levels. That's all. That's all, man. It just looks cool. It just looks cool. What do you want from me? What do you want from me? It's pointless, but it's cool. And the beavers look kind of nice standing there. Since our wood levels are back up to uh, reasonable amounts, uh, we're gonna start. We're gonna start with something. Uh, <laughs> something. Some a little goofy. Uh, <laughs> it's gonna involve deleting the bridges, which means we gotta do like a thing, like a like a stair thing. So we're gonna do that real quick. We're gonna delete both of the bridge. Uh, yeah, we're gonna delete both the bridges. That's fine. And those stairs are gonna be necessary cause you'll see in a minute, in a minute. Uh, 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 uh. I guess we're gonna need, we gotta get rid of our uh, oopsie beaver. You're underway. Okay, um, once that's built, we can uh, move forward with our stupid plan that I got. All right, the stairs are built, which means we can get rid of this other bridge also, uh, unfortunately. 
And let's talk through my plan. My plan is a little silly. I'll admit, I'll admit it's a little silly. You see these stairs? I don't like that they're on platforms. It feels not, you know, solid enough. It's not like a thing. So like in theory, like if they're gonna stay there and go to the back with bridges like we want, then like what we really wanna do is levees, right? Like levees look cool. They'd be like a wall that's around this and it works, but here's the problem with levees. See the problem? They are, uh, they're ground only. So, <laughs> here's the thing that's gonna happen now. So if we're ready to, to get, get dirty. dirty. <laughs> Do need a new district though. <laughs> All right, that one will serve temporarily and be just fine. All right, and the reason for this is uh, to do this. We want to, oh, uh, 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 okay. <laughs> I guess that had to happen too. Uh-oh, uh-oh, we got a bunch of stranded beavers. Why? Uh, uh, oh, looks like they need a road. All right, we can do that, make it high priority, and put a, there you go. They'll be fine now. Okay. Oh, we need roads up to there too. Uh, all right, let's just do that for now. We'll figure we'll figure it out after something more better. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I think that'll work. Okay. Um, so here's what we're doing. Going straight up. It's gonna take a minute to get all the way up, but we're doing it anyway. All right. So I realized that was a huge waste of materials, right? But but now we have a solid, like, very solid foundation. And we're gonna do the stairs going up over here and maybe, like, a little back thing for the district center as kind of like a, I don't, I don't know, something? As a something? I don't know what yet. Maybe, how was the bridge? Also, this way we can, we got, we had to do that anyway because we had to rebuild the bridges because they weren't even sizes. So there's gonna be five and five. So it's gonna be right there. That needs to be four levels up. Like that. That's, okay, well, that one's in the wrong place, first of all. But basically, we're going up to there, and then that's going to connect across like that. Like, that's that's going to be the thing eventually. But not yet, because we got to build this up like that and like that. Like, that's what we're going to do. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's what we're going to do. Okay. Uh, I'm going to delete it for now, though. So that way they can build the whole foundation here. And once that's built, we can figure something out. <laughs> Hey, it's all built. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So we can pause. Delete that. Uh, drop a new one. <laughs> Loving these district centers not costing nothing. <laughs> Easy peasy. All right. Uh, and then the next plan. Next plan is to obviously do the, the stair thing. But then also, I mean, we want to make it a little fancy. So maybe I was thinking like, like something back here. You know, make it like a like a thing, like the district center, bridgey center thing. Those are words. This is gonna have to be built in stages, so that way they can actually build the whole thing. Because otherwise, they could build like the sides first, and then they can't build this part at all. So we're gonna we're gonna let them let them just do the thing, like one thing at a time. All right, that's built up, so we could go up next level. It's a little tedious, I agree, but I want to get there successfully. And since we're going with absurd constructions today, I also had an idea for up here, maybe. So we gotta do that first. And then, and then I'll show you my plan. <laughs> it might be a stupid plan. I don't know yet. Also, as I was watching this, I was also thinking like, should we just delete these dams? Like we don't really need them. And this water could just like cascade over the top and it might look nicer. Let me know. Let me know your opinions, thoughts. Feelings. All right, these are built. My idea is two. But wait, oh, that's four. I thought that was gonna be three. All right, that's fine. That's fine. It can still work. We'll figure it out. Basically, we're gonna go up to the top over here, and it's gonna be multi-purpose actually. Uh, mostly because of I'm thinking of doing like a statue up here or something for decoration. But also, it'll actually save us water because uh, this whole middle 
This whole thing is just evaporating all the time. We need it to make this area green so we can have pretty flowers and trees and stuff. But we don't need it to be all the way deep and in like that. So we're going to do this and we'll see what happens. But this way it doesn't matter because the water's on the outside. So it's still keeping all this green the exactly the same way. There's just less volume of water for it to be evaporated. You know what I mean? Yeah, you do. All right, next level. Next level. And this might be the, uh, uh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, Octoc. We almost had it. <laughs> Whoops. There you go. There you go. Calm down. Calm down. We're okay. We're okay. Nobody freak out. I caught it. I caught it. All right, we're going to go up like that. Actually, these should be high priority. Otherwise, they get stuck. These stairs have to go up all the way, but this part doesn't. This is the part that's going to have something. I don't know yet. All right. We're finally to the top. We're finally there. This is all, this is all good. It's all done. So we're going to pause and we're going to mock up what it's going to look like so that we know. Because we're going to have this and that there. And then we're going to have the bridges coming off that. Right? So that's going to be like that. We're going to have stairs right there. And then... Then what? Do you want this going all the way up? Is that a... Mm, no, I don't know. Do you want just like beaver statues? <laughs> this definitely should be like a level lower. So maybe we didn't need to build that. Like that? Is that... Uh, can't really... Uh, Maybe instead of the plant... A bell? Bell's tall. Maybe get rid of that. Put another bell? Two bells? Double bell? Yeah, I guess I don't mind that. Let's go with the... Let's go with this option. So we're going to leave those there. We're going to get rid of this for now so that they're able to build this. We're going to make those high priority. And we're going to wait a minute on the outside beavers. That way they can build everything. Okay. What do we think? How's, uh, how's our new center of power looking? Is that good? Do we... Do we like it? No, I, I think I like it. I think I like it as it is. I think it looks cool. I'm not sure... Going higher would have been too high compared to the district center. I think. And I kind of like it. Maybe we get rid of these guys? Because they're blocking it. Ooh, yeah, that's good. I like that. That's nice. That'll look real good when we got the promenade going. Still not sure what I want to do with the promenade, but... Mm, it'll be something. <laughs> Alright, next thing to do is to queue up some more platforms. Because we almost have enough metal for them. Uh, we definitely have enough for at least two. Let's do that. Uh, and that's because that's, that's where our engines are going to go. I'm still thinking about doing the engines like back here. Kind of like along the back, like this. I don't know. I don't know. That's still what I'm thinking. Maybe with wood storage underneath. So maybe it would be something like that. Like, that looks kind of cool. And then we'd have the power shafts running behind. And maybe we'd leave gaps in between so the power shafts can go around. And then that way the power shafts can also go up. You know what I mean? They can go this way or that way or whatever. Plus it would just look cool to have like a whole row of them like back here powering our entire colony. Because <laughs> we need... What do we need? We got 11 right now, I think. So it'd be sort of something like that. And I mean, I, I think that looks really cool. Like super industrial. We would just, like I said, need gap somewhere. Maybe like underneath the bridge for the power lines to come through. Or maybe we could get away with not, maybe we could just get away with an even number, 10. I don't know, I don't know. We'll figure it out. Gotta build the platforms first. All right, the next big thing, while they're still doing the chimney build, uh, I'm still, well, or, so originally, there's no originally. So I had thought, and a couple of you brought it up, is that, well, basically we have an issue in that the water pumps, the path from the water pumps to the water tanks is really far. Like they have to go <laughs> basically the whole length of the map because they got to go all the way across there, go down and then go to the tanks and all the way back. And that's super inefficient. So we really just need a more direct path. And I kind of was thinking of doing the mountain pass to nowhere, maybe. So basically my thought process is we go down here from, from the pumps. If we can go down here into the, into the tunnel, into the path, and then make our way over here and then down straight towards the tanks. Now, 
the observant amongst you are saying, but Moro, there's a problem. The problem is this, uh, this refill aqueduct doesn't work if we do that. Because you can't go under it. So it needs to try push water this way. We can't, we can't just like walk underneath it or through it if, if that's there. So that's a little bit of a problem. So that's mainly, if we're going to do that, that's kind of the thing we got to figure out. A semi-easy solution would be to just cut, like just dig down, make a big ass hole over here. <laughs> so that the, when the water comes this way, it overflows and then gets caught at the bottom in the ditch and goes to the side. And then goes that way to refill the, the farm and to fill this up. The only problem is that it needs to be four high, really. Or at least three. No, four. It needs to be four high. So even then, it doesn't give us a super wonderful path. So I don't know. Alright, well, to fully figure it out, first thing we gotta do, I think, is move the carrot farmhouse situation. So that's gonna go, like, right there. Like, that's a good, that's fine. And then we're gonna plant carrots over here so we can get rid of the other carrots. At least for now. Temporary carrots. Plus, now there'll be like cave carrots. Almost. They're cavey. Yeah, that's a, there's a good carrots right there. There's gonna be good carrots. Alright, so that means we can get rid of this building, get rid of the road, and dig up all them carrots now. Because we don't, we don't need that. Okay, those are going to be gone. That'll help us visualize and figure out things. Hey, our dumb little chimney platform thing is done. So, what I was thinking of is that right there. <laughs> uh, yeah? <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, I think that's the move. That's a good mover. Do we want it? Do we want it a level lower? Uh, huh, maybe. Unless, I mean, we do have these spaces in front, so maybe if we put, like, that maybe? Yeah, I mean, that's alright. These floodgates are kind of in the way. We don't really need them anymore, either. Can I safely just delete these? <laughs> uh, how much water is in there? Yeah, we're almost, we're almost down to three levels below. Okay, so let's, well, first of all, are we, are we leaving that? Are we happy? Definitely leaving the big one. The big one's at least staying. The little, little ones can stay, too. That's fine. Whatever. Uh, we might need to build them in order. Okay. Um, and then I'm just gonna delete these. We'll leave one. And, I mean, that looks a little asymmetrical, but... Mm, whatever. <laughs> At some point, you know, it is what it is. You know, maybe we do make it symmetrical. Maybe, maybe the way to handle this is to build something over here that goes down, like, over here. In order to refill this aqueduct. And then we would just have two separate gates. One for this side and one for here and that side. Maybe? I don't know. They gotta build this out first. And then we'll think about it. Gonna make this a uh, lower priority. Because <laughs> that's a lot of things to bring. I just realized we never put a bell over here. Ugh. The travesty. Which way was it? No, it's facing this way. Okay. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. You guys would have murdered me if I didn't put that back. <laughs> Did we have a bench in front of it? No, I, don't, I think it was just a bell, right? Should I put a bench in front of it? Well, let's let's build that and we'll figure it out. That's all filled in, so we're gonna put the last beaver statue, because the bell's built, and we're gonna destroy this to make the floodgate symmetrical. I guess we don't need the... Uh, crap. No, they, they can still build it from the other side, because this is lower prior... Yeah, they'll still be able to build this. Okay. <laughs> It's, that was almost a big annoying mistake. All right, and that's the next floodgate, which would mean the water would drop into there and then go somewhere. My thought, my thought process behind this whole path, if, if it's going to be there and if it's going to exist, I kind of want it to be invisible. So it would go down and it would go underneath the path. And then we'd still have this path here. This, the, the mountain pass to nowhere will still be there. But there'll be a secret pass underneath to somewhere, if, if, if that makes sense, you know? And then I want it to go down, and then I guess, like, maybe around somehow? And then at some point, the water would also go down here and flow backwards and then drop, waterfall style, and then push forward. And then the, the path would kind of go over it and then go down and over here. 
but secretly. <laughs> I'm just not sure how to do that. It's a problem. Alright, so in order to figure this out, I, uh, I don't know. I need to be able to see it. So I'm gonna get rid of these guys. Uh, I'm gonna start, I'm gonna start the engine situation over here. At least a little bit. With two engines. Plus that way we can at least see how it feels to have them here. You know? Alright, so that's the thing that we're gonna do. It's gonna waste a little bit of metal. But, that's okay. <laughs> And then, and then I can delete those smelters and those engines. Maybe I could just do that now. Let's just pause it. Because they got to be emptied anyway. Alright, so these are basically empty. Empty enough, they have a few logs, but whatever. We don't care. Let's get rid of that, we can get rid of these. And now, now we can start to think. Maybe, maybe we take a break from hot tubs. No hot tubs. So we're going to pause that too, get rid of this one. Alright, that's empty, we're going to get rid of that. Uh, we're going to have to do... I think the whole hot tub area is going to need to be, um, <laughs> worked on. <laughs> uh, let's move, let's move the tanks first. How's that for tanks? That work? <laughs> Does that work for you guys? I like the ones down here. It's kind of cool. And then, I don't know, we needed four more. So I stuck them over here. Because this is, this was kind of asymmetrical and it was, I mean, it was bugging me a little bit. It was probably bugging some of you too. But this way it looks... I don't know, like almost purposefully asymmetrical? I don't really know. But there's there's ten 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 tanks. Ten 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 uh ten tanks. And once those are built, we'll delete the other ones. We might have a little dip in population. Maybe I'll uh, no, once those are built, well I'm gonna delete the other ones. And I guess if we're gonna go down, we gotta start building something stairwise. I'm just curious about where it's actually going to like dip under. So if we go like that, and that's where it connects, then it would go under and under these two, but that actually works pretty well. I'm not sure if this engine is going to stay. We might leave it, maybe, because it does fit in nice here and we did make a hole for it. <laughs> uh, so maybe only 10 engines are going to go in the main area. All right, clearing up the final thing, which is that. And now, oh, was that build already? Wow, that was fast. All right, that's that's good. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna get rid of the path. We're gonna get rid of that path. I guess we're gonna have to get rid of this whole path if we're gonna go blow it down. Right. I guess the curve cell is gonna be out of business for a little while. I think the easiest way to do it is just destroy this. If we just get rid of that, there'll be. <laughs> <laughs> They'll be able to just plant straight down. That'll be pretty easy, actually. Alright, so we get rid of the path. And... Just gotta blow the whole thing down? Yeah? I mean, I, I guess we're going for it. This, fe this feels very, very final. <laughs> uh, okay. Well, apparently while I was messing around, our next set of platforms are built. <laughs> I did not even notice. Uh... So that's cool. That's cool. Our statue still isn't built yet, though, so they're working on that one. That's gonna be 300 more metal. I guess I should queue up the next three? I mean, we don't have enough metal, but whatever. <laughs> Alright, since we're a little bit far away from, uh, actually completing everything, I'm gonna get rid of that road, I'm gonna build another engine. <laughs> uh, cause I want- I want to get rid of these wheels. They're not, uh, they're wasting too many jobs, I need them as haulers. There you go. This looks terrible. I know. Just let it be. That's what it is right now. All right, and that means we can get rid of these wheels. And that's five. That's five more haulers, basically five more employees. Because right now we're having uh we're having some issues. <laughs> we have efficiency issues, and so it's causing all of our industry to kind of suck right now. And that's not great. I, I'd like to avoid it if I can. Um, that's gonna be a little too much power actually, because this only needs 240. So I really need to connect this into everything else there's too many entrances everywhere i can't <laughs> there's nowhere for the uh for the shaft to go because it needs three spots and there's not three spots anywhere it's a little bit irritating just a little bit all right this is gonna look terrible okay there we go i'm aware it looks like hot garbage okay sorry <laughs> that's this is that's just what it's gonna be for right now
All right, so this is the right amount. We finally got there. We just have to close it up like nothing was ever there. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, it still technically goes to nowhere because it goes all the way to this square right there and that doesn't go anywhere. So that's that's still to nowhere, right? <laughs> all right, I just decided I'm not going to build this out right now because it's actually going to be easier. Oh, no. I think that's three drinks right there. Maybe just one collective big drink. Um, it's just going to be easier to figure out without having it blocked off. So that's going to get rebuilt. And what I'm thinking is like to just make a path going straight over here. Like straight down. And then this would go here, go over that, and then go around. And then that, so that would work. Maybe. So that would still be something like that. The rest of the land would still be fine. Right? Yeah, I think so. Alright, I deleted- I deleted that, because now that, like, I'm looking at it, it could actually go anywhere. We don't have to blow it all the way over there, because it's just the path- No, because the path still needs to go that way. This is difficult. <laughs> this is difficult. Yeah, I mean, I guess this way is the easiest. It's just a matter of where it gets water from. That's the only part that changes. I'm trying to picture this and I'm having trouble. So I'm going to just build, I'm going to put this here. So if that's there and it's going down to four, I just, I need them to cross over somewhere and go around. So, I mean, I guess over here is as good a place as any. All right. I'm just going to go for it. I don't know if it's going to work, but we're going to blow this down and it's going to be kind of like a waterfall into here while they cross over and go around. I have no idea if this is going to work or not, but I'm just going to do it. <laughs> that's screw it. You know? So here's a funny thing that happened. That warehouse I destroyed was our, uh, <laughs> was our explosives warehouse. And <laughs> we don't have another one. <laughs> oh, boy. All right. <laughs> We're going to build those two. And uh, that's going to be explosives. 400. It'll be okay. Temporary location. <laughs> and we have plenty of production, but I was just like, these explosives are taking a minute. It's because uh, we have nowhere to store them. Each of these can only hold five. So... We had a storage of 20. That was a win for me. The back tank is finally dry on day 45. That means it took 35 days to empty this out. It is really slow. It is really slow, and this this secret pathway needs to really produce for us. Because <laughs> the efficiency of this is terrible. Anybody that doubted why I kept the tank in the middle and kept the pumps there and everything, this is why. This is why the pumps in the back, very long distance to, to the water tanks. Even though they're like everywhere in the middle here, it's just long. Before the pumps were like right here, the tanks were right here, we had more tanks all around. I mean, it's just, I know I, I know, I deleted a bunch of the tanks that were close to the back, but I'm just saying distance makes a huge difference. So having that in the center area where it was in the middle of the whole map, able to go to any tanks anywhere, was a very good thing. I mean, I still like the back tank. Don't get me wrong. We're making it work. We're figuring it out. However, <laughs> having all that storage right next to it was real nice because it emptied way faster. All right. That's the final level. So the theory goes, we're going to go here. Uh, or I guess that's not the final level. Or should it be the final level? Because we're not actually going to keep water in here. So this might need to go up. Alright, we're going to build that. And then we're going to be a little risky. Because we're, we're running short on time. But I don't care. I want to figure this out. So we're going to delete that. And I guess we, we got to blow that down anyway. Because I just... I need... I, I, I just can't... I'm a very visual person. And I can't... I just can't picture it. I mean, I can picture it, but not really. Not in a way that makes me happy. So we're going to do that. And so my, my basically my plan is to have the water kind of come in here, fall off, go that way, which will fill there, right? While the path goes forward over the water, and then there are going to be stairs going down over here, and they'll have access right there, right to the tanks. And that's a that's a pretty straight path. The only straighter path would be straight through, 
but I kind of don't really want to destroy all this earth. And also, I think it'd be more difficult to force the water to go around without spilling and stuff. But I think this way will work. Maybe. And I guess this whole square is just doesn't need to be there anymore, but we'll, we'll see. I don't want to delete it yet in case we need it for at least this wet season. But we're going to build that. We're going to blow this down. And I think this should be okay. I mean, this is at four high right now. So that's, it's basically at the ceiling of this. So I might need to blow it down once. Unless, unless I want to do the levee like over here. You know, I guess either way this has to go down too. I mean, I really planned this really well. That's built so we can, nobody's in the temple. Okay, nobody's in the temple. Get rid of that. And so this whole thing needs to go down. Okay. Okay, I'm start I'm starting to visualize this. I'm starting to get there. <laughs> Somewhere where that is. I don't I don't know. All right. So that's done. So that in theory would just go right in here and fill this up. The problem with blowing it down one more level is that it might there would be extra water left over. Cuz for this to flood into there, it's got to be a three and a half levels and we need three levels in here total max like filled to, filled to three levels in order for this to be green so that's why we have it filling to like three and a half give or take all right so we're gonna leave this i'm gonna do a little pathway up and over and hopefully that'll be enough if it's not enough we might need to go too high but that's the thing there and i guess either way we got to blow this down and maybe even over here is that ground or is that yeah that's ground also okay so that's got to go down also and i think the rest of that is just levees okay yeah so that's all that's all that's fine all right that one's down all the way so we can just do this and then okay that goes once more and then that should be fine all right we gotta we gotta make this into a floodgate for now <laughs> oh man, this is a mess. This is a mess. It's complicated to figure out. Alright, that's the last one for that. And then the, these ones are just going to go scaling downward to make stairs. If it works. If it doesn't, uh, we might need to go build a levee over here. But I think it should be fine. I don't think there, there's going to be enough water flow to really screw this up. If there is, it's because it's turning. And that would really suck. <laughs> but hopefully that's not the case. Alright, we got one more dynamite left. And that I think that's like basically the ground. Is that the ground? Or is, is there one more? Alright, we got one more level after that. Uh, Do we turn it? I guess we should turn it. Which means deleting this. Is that fine? I think that's fine. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Wait. Wait. <laughs> uh... Okay, yeah, I just stranded a bunch of beavers. Whoops. Quick, quick. Build a bridge. A tiny bridge. <laughs> it's okay. That's okay. Nobody freak out. I guess I didn't need to blow that then. But it's okay. That's how we learn. Can we build? I can't build stairs there. Damn it. What's on top? That's a tank. Can we build stairs there? I think. Yeah, I think I can. All right. And so that's where the stairs are going to go. Oh. Uh, Okay, and it can, I guess if we went down one more, it would connect into there like perfectly. All right, in the interest of mild, mild OCD satisfaction, <laughs> let's, <laughs> oh man, let's just go in that direction. So one more step down. Oh, I did not need to delete that whole thing then. Okay, I'm going to delete the next one too then and build a bigger bridge. Okay. <laughs> High priority. Oh, this is confusing. So we delete that then. And that goes right there. And just connects right into the system. Perfect. I think, yeah, that's that's pretty good. Right? God, I hope so. Oh, what a mess. Well, it's not really a mess. I mean, I think that worked out pretty well, relatively speaking. We can probably just delete all these blocks here. Do we really need to build that? No, we need that bridge right now. Once everything works, we can figure it out. Okay, so that's all set, I think. 
Uh, we got two days until the wet season. We are not going to do a montage. We're going to skip it so that we can actually figure this out and finish this. <laughs> oh, fancy waterfall. <laughs> Man, it feels weird to talk during a uh, wet season. Haven't, haven't done that in a while. But I did want to address how cool this is. Very cool. Why is it going like in and out? You see that? It's weird. It's weird. It's almost you see you see the flow. There's like a different. I think it's because of uh because of this. It's slightly impeding the flow of the water. Here comes the grand test. Are they gonna take the short way? <laughs> God, I hope so. All right, the pumps are pumping. Where the haulers at? I want to see some itty bitty backpacks. Let's go. Let's go. No backpacks. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Michael Beard. He's haul. Oh, okay. <laughs> Different angle. Okay, he's going. He's going. He's going. We're going to speed it up. We're going to speed up where he's going to go. He's going to go. Oh, oh, yes. 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 Oh. Deposit and return and return. Look at that. Look how fast that is. Perfect. Oh, they're all going. Oh, that is so good. They're going that they're going there and they're coming back from there. That's how you know it's a good step. Alright. Good. That's step one. <laughs> step one is to make sure that that was shorter. I mean it is. There's no way it's not. Like that's we're cutting out this whole walkway right here. See that? Because they're just going down. I mean, they, they do have to turn, but mm, that's just going to have to stay. All right. This is going to be the real test. We're going to drop the floodgate and we're going to open this thing up. All right. All right. So long as it doesn't flood when it comes over here, Moro's a happy boy. There it goes. Are we okay? It is working. All right? Yeah, it works. Cool. <laughs> okay, good. Don't have to do anything else. Okay, so that goes in there. It channels through and pours in here and then goes down over there. And that's it. And that this should, this is, there's never going to be water left over. Because as it's going down, it's going to come out of here at 3.5 height. So that's not really an issue. Granted, we still have to do the, the actual waterway for, for this exit because that way we'll have one for the right side one for the left side and it's all separate and then it just it's gonna i think it's, it's good it's good words mean good <laughs> okay i closed it and it stopped flowing and everything went over here and it's fine everything's fine all right <laughs> okay <laughs> oh man when things work out it's beautiful all right we're just waiting for this to finish I don't want to do anything until that happens. Otherwise, mistakes get made. <laughs> All right. So in looking at the pumps, we can already see a massive difference because the productivity before was at like 40 something percent for most of them. Right now, we got 60, 80, 50, 70, 65, 75, 65. That's 46. That's not great. 73, 52. I mean, it'll still average out, but that already means that this pathway is working great so while this was stressful it was very worth it and i think we can make it look pretty cool too because so long as this is like i don't know i mean we might get rid of this part and then and then it'll just look like the earth is just connecting there and it's like like nothing's even there like there's no there's no pathway except except that we all know that there's a secret pathway yeah <laughs> And with that done, things are looking pretty good for Metal City, I would say, huh? <laughs> we got a little little district center rebuild. We got our statue up top. At some point, that's going to need power. But right now, I'm not worrying about it. And we got our secret little pathway. The little little path. It's great. Uh, next up, we got we to gotta figure this out. We got to figure out. I mean, I, we might just blow it down and just leave it. I'm not sure. But we got to do that. We got to seal this all back up. Now that we know it's working and figure out what we're going to do over here. But aside from that, I love you guys. I'm Moro. Like the video. Subscribe if you're not. And I'll catch you guys next time.